Bad time. No, gosh, no. Come on. Thanks. Uh, look, uh, I know I said I couldn't lean on you anymore, but uh, there's nobody else I want to talk to right now. I am. I am here for you for whatever you need. Always. Tell me what's going on. Just racking my brain, trying to find a way to get through the Oscar. I, I just, I just got to be there for him, you know? I got to make life better for him. And uh, it's not like they can just drop a cure in his hands, you know? Yeah, I know. I mean, if only. Yeah. I just want him to live the best life he can, and I don't even know what that means. What I'm telling you right now, you don't have to do it alone. This experience of finding out about Oscar's diagnosis, it's, uh, it's been <laughs> overwhelming, but um, man, it's crazy. Who knows? Who doesn't know? And uh, it's pretty mind-blowing how intertwined it all is. Right. What is? Us, our lives, you know, and, how many people are tied to me, to you, to Oscar. And how some of these relationships, they just, they form without me even realizing it. I mean, take Monica. It's, <laughs> she loves that kid. He is her grandchild. It's like all her other grandchildren. Yeah, but that's Monica. It's the same way she loves you. With Oscar, that bond happened almost like overnight. When you think about it, Monica's lost so much. That is an understatement, more than anyone should. Don't get me wrong. She's been great. I mean, she's been strong for me, for my son, but... I just that... I can't stand the thought of her losing anyone else. True. Hey, wait a minute. Look at me. You don't have to do this alone. It's just impossible to make a decision for one person without affecting all the others. Like, I just want to be a good dad to all my kids, but my son, he needs me to think of only him right now, and I just, I can't do it. Look, God knows if we could give Oscar a cure, we would, but all we can really do is be there for him in the time that he has left, and hopefully that is decades upon decades, but if it's not, you're gonna need people to lean on. I don't care about me. I care about giving him what he needs. He needs you. <laughs> He does. He needs you to be focused and, and present and not lost in this big, looming, scary picture. And look, I know I've said it before. Find grace in every day. Little moments. Yeah. Little moments. Because they're everywhere. And in the end, they're all that really matters. <laughs>